Hey, welcome back to How to Barbecue Right. I'm Malcolm Reed. Today I'm going to show you how I do a classic southern coleslaw. It's going to be creamy, a little sweet, and a little tangy, and it's made with just a few ingredients and it goes with any kind of barbecue. Let's get to cooking. So to make a good coleslaw, first we got to have some cabbage. I've just got a head of fresh cabbage that I shredded up, and then we need a dressing to go with it. I have some mayo, I have some sugar, and then I've got some cider vinegar. That's all that's going in it. We're going to season it up a little bit after we get it mixed up, and that's going to make our slaw dressing. So now we're going to season our mixture. I've got a little bit of celery seed we're going to add to it. Got a little bit of black pepper. You don't have to put all of it. Then we need a good pinch or two of salt. So now we have to combine our slaw dressing and our coleslaw. Now I'm just dumping the whole head of cabbage off in a big Ziploc bag. And I've found it so much easier to mix up this way. You can store it in the refrigerator. You can take it to an event if you're going traveling with it, but it's cleaner and it's a lot easier than stirring it in the bowl. You want to scrape all that goodness out. Now I'm just going to get all the air out of the bag or as much as possible. And we just got to toss it. So mix it in the bag, it gets covered really well, and coleslaw has to come together. It needs to rest in the refrigerator now for at least an hour. I've even let it set overnight before, but it's perfect to transport. We'll leave it in this bag the whole time, put it in the refrigerator, and then we get ready to serve it, we'll just dump it out into our serving bowl. It's ready to go. So we've had our coleslaw hanging out in the refrigerator for about an hour. Now it's time to get it ready to serve. And you can see it's come together really well. It starts pulling some of the moisture out of it. And keeping it in that Ziploc bag made it that much easier. And now we have perfect bowl of coleslaw ready to serve. And I'm gonna get some out here. You can see the seasoning we put in it, that black pepper and celery seed, all the flavors that a classic coleslaw should have. That's what we have. Now for the ultimate thing, it's time to try this coleslaw. Just see how good it is. Hmm. textbook. It's sweet, it's tangy, it's creamy. All the flavors you'd want in a good coleslaw and it's super simple to do. Next time you're having a barbecue, you want to serve up a good side, give this coleslaw recipe a shot. Mm. And that's easy southern style coleslaw. If you like what we're doing here on How to Barbecue Right, subscribe to our channel. You can find us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we're going to wrap up everything we do with a podcast at the end of the week. We'll see y'all next time. Coleslaw and baked beans and chicken. Shell, that's a happy man right there. Mm.